Chicken and wines. What's up, guys? We're on our way. We're gonna go get a little night stroll. Get out of the house real quick with Alexander. He's running over here. He's excited uh, to get out for a little bit. Come on, guys. When we didn't have cars, all we wanted to do is drive. And we're here in quarantine. We can drive everywhere. Just don't get out. Are you ready? See. Let's go. We are heading out for a drive. Yeah. Do you think it's a necessity to do it? 
No. Does this feel like it's less slimy, I guess? In a way, even though working with chicken is always slimy. A lot of people don't like doing it. Actually, there's some videos of uh, people doing it, they use uh, gloves doing it. Which, for right now, there's a shortage of. So I don't know if they can continue to use it, but it's kind of crazy that they use gloves every time they handle chicken. So, that one guy, I forgot what his name Zach Erna, 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 on YouTube, he has to wear gloves every time he handles chicken. So, he has one glove on and one glove off. Chicken gloves, ready to go. That's a little too much. I feel like if you're going to cook, you have to get used to handling slimy things or or nasty things too, you know, whatever. Eventually, you put it off. Anyways, we're gonna dice these up right now. Alright, so I had to wash the cutting board again because I should cut the beef first and then the chicken on it, I guess. I don't have to know pieces of fat, but whatever. Fat is flavor, I guess, at this point. I'm supposed to be cutting right now, pretty much. I think the whole world's supposed to be cutting right now. But now with this whole thing going on right now, we can't get, I'm just cutting in different pieces, I don't really care. The whole world's supposed to be cutting right now, but we can't get our, our produce what we used to get because it's so like uh, scarce. So I'm just cutting little pieces right now. I'm just gonna um, dice it up and put it in so it cooks faster. All right, we got our beef cut up right here. It took a long time. It's skirt steak, so it's a little tough, like, you know, a little fibrous and stuff like that, but it's pretty good, good flavor and stuff like that. It's the only thing you can really find right now out there. Uh, now we're gonna do our chicken breasts, which, you know how it is. Just slice and dice it like this in little cubes and stuff like that. I'm just drilling in little pieces so it could cut, uh, cook a little faster. It's actually pretty late right now. What time is it gonna be? Like, 10. 10, what is it back there? 10, 15, 10, 13. And, uh, you know, I just decided to do like, my meal prep because I haven't done it this whole week and actually we did do his meal prep. We did his chicken and rice and he did eat it last time which is good. So uh, you know he's getting back on his schedule too right now which I want to because or else it's just pop tarts and bagels and chips and pretty much that's all these kids are eating and that's why they're going crazy and you know can't stay still for a little while. So we're doing our best. Hope you guys are doing your best. Um, we're gonna keep the grind going gonna keep the workouts going um, you know actually this guy my son he's actually the one that's actually keep me motivated to keep going because he says to go work out muscles but he really just wants to go to the garage and play so it's just an excuse for him but it gets me going there too and then I feel guilty because I don't want to go work out because I'm tired but you know he wants to go in there and play and even if it just works out for with me for a little bit but gets me going and gets him playing. So uh, anyways, we're gonna keep on slicing and dicing all this meat and then uh, let's go and season it. All right, so we got everything cut up now and we're gonna start seasoning them. And I guess with the chicken, I'm gonna do this lemon pepper and this uh, complete seasoning right here. But you know what, I started putting chili flakes on everything now. It just makes everything taste better. You know, ever, ever since uh, my, my dad got me hooked up on his salsa, habanero salsa, I need everything with spice. So for the steak, I'm just going to use this buttery steakhouse from Kinder's. I can use the same thing over and over again. And that's a big plus, especially if you do meal prep, because you're going to be eating the same thing over and over again. That's something that's really good about me and my wife also, because she likes to eat everything the same thing over and over again, right? Uh-uh. Yeah, so we're working on her with that right there. Like... She, she could eat this every day, right, huh? Uh-uh. All right, so we're going to start cooking the meat right now. We got the pans preheating. We got Alexander here. Where are we cooking? What are, who's this? The can is this? The... Chicken and rice. It's chicken and rice right here. We got chicken and rice. This guy was asking for chicken and rice right now, actually. After he ate his quesadillas. And um, so he was saying that this one's, this one's papi. The can is this? The... This is my meat right here. Hmm. So, uh, you know, he likes it. And um, we're going to start cooking these. We're going to preheat it right now. So, uh, we're about to put them in right now. There, so, let's put these on. Kind of high. On eight. Make sure to preheat, preheat your pans, people. And then, uh, let's stick this in right here. Probably 
light. Turn on this fan. I was about to say, uh, that looks, smells good. There it goes. Uh, so we're gonna leave that cooking right here. We're gonna get some lids. I'm actually gonna um, put some, some broccoli now into it. Because, you know, we want to indoors right now. Alexander wants to steal the show. Okay, I'll let you see it right now. So I'm adding broccoli just to want something fresh, something green that we're not really eating right now. Everything is carbs right now. So it feels like I'm kind of on a bulk season right now. Uh, it feels like it because, you know, we're not eating so lean as we used to. Usually we do bulk time, you know, we're eating a little bit more carbs, getting a little more bigger, but that's okay. We'll, we work with what we got. Oh yeah, look at that meat. All right guys, we're done. We have all the stuff measured out. We weighed them out individually. Uh, it's a little off by, my normal standards, what I used to do, but we're working with what we got. But anyways, thank you guys for joining me for this night edition of Cooking with Mike, Chicken and Rice Crew, um, and Alexander is part over there, passed out, and we're ready to go to sleep. But I have to get this done because we want to keep going as good as we can with our workout you know, routine. But anyways, hope you guys had a good one. Stay safe out there, you know, protect your guys self from everything happening around this world right now. We love you guys very much, and until next video, guys.